it's the spooktical, it's the spook. It's the spooktical season, and something haunting is happening over at the spooktical spectacle. I'm Monster Handler Charlie, and this is Monster Mythos. The smunkle lanterns are lit, leaves have fallen from the trees, and shadows are growing. The season has truly become cold and haunting. But don't be discouraged, for Spooktacle is here, and monsters from all around the monster world are gathering to show off their best costumes in the spectacular spectacle. But Sponge noticed some strangeness. It saw something quickly on the corner of its eye, and a chilling song drifted on the wind. An eerie presence, perhaps? Something maybe from beyond? Sponge donned its best costume and decided to investigate. Sponge entered a small forest away from the costume contest rabble. There was a faint glow through the trees. Sponge heard quiet humming as it crept closer and closer to the mysterious green glow. Sponge emerged from the bushes only to find Parlsona mixing a green cauldron. Parlsona was making green apple punch for Spooktacle. Or was it Spectacle? Or is it both? Or Never mind. Suddenly, they both heard the strange song, hauntingly through the trees, and something lurked in the forest. Parlsona decided to help Sponge in the phantasmal quest. The two made their way to the rocky cliffs at the edge of the forest. When they noticed something was following them, it was approaching slowly, getting nearer and nearer. It was Mammoth, dressed in their signature stentorian skeleton costume. Mammoth said it had also heard strange noises and had seen shadows in the dark. So Mammoth joined the investigative crew. The three monsters continued through the cliffs where they found a cave and a chilling song omitted from within. Sponge, determined to see the end to the mystery, led the others into the cave. A red glow cast across the walls as the tunnel twisted and turned. The three entered into a large den where a haunting thing loomed over them. It was Furcorn all along, practicing their song for the talent show in the spectacle. Furcorn had been running around Plant Island, wearing its costume and trying to find a place with good acoustics, and found it here in this cave. The ghostly mystery was over. Each of the monsters returned to the spooktical spectacle where everyone showed off their ghoulish garbs. And Furcorn won the contest for its very spooktacular song.